Uh, hello, I am Arjun Sharma, and this is my presentation for uh, my first artificial intelligence app that I have made. Um, this is to translate Indian Sign Language into text, okay? So the main objective of this app is basically to help people translate sign language to improve the communication between those who can speak and those who cannot. Uh, the main reason for me choosing this is that from what I've seen online, um, there's not really many uh, solutions to translating uh, Indian Sign Language. Most of them are for American Sign Language. So uh, I thought it could be uh, more useful than making something for an American Sign Language. Um, plus, it also helps me improve my skills in artificial intelligence, uh, mainly in image recognition, uh, so that in the future, uh, using this knowledge I have gained here, I can improve myself and make even better programs and train better AIs to make a more useful app that has better prediction consistency and just looks better in general. Now, continuing on to the actual app here, uh, this is the home screen of my app, uh, very basic. We have the title here, and here we have the a button. This is the translate button. Uh, right here, just make the button here. This is the image I used to make it look a bit nicer, uh, curved corners, okay? So if you start this, um, it opens the second screen. That is right here, this screen, okay? Uh, this is the upload button, this is the home button, right here, home and upload. If you click the home button, uh, it closes that window, brings you back here. Okay, uh, if you see here, when you click the home button, um, it destroys the window and then closes it, okay? And then just opens the home window. Uh, so if you go back here, uh, next we have the upload button. That opens like a dialog, uh, like a file explorer dialog from which you can select some image. Say if I select number seven, I'll now print here the output, which is Y. Um, if we just look here again, seven, it is in the Y part. Let's click that uh, and this that. Uh, let me just go home, uh, refresh it. Say we select five now. That will again, give me Y. Okay. So that happens right here. Uh, whenever I click this button, it runs the commands for the upload button. So that is just the upload image command where it opens the file dialog and reads the image from that place. Okay. Then resize and reshapes the image so it can be used in the um, prediction algorithm. Okay. And then I run the predict function, which actually predicts it. So here I have make an array from the image. Okay. So that the, because the model can only use number inputs or array inputs. Okay. I'm just resizing it so it can be better used. Here, uh, I'm just running the predict function here, dot predict. And this is so that I can change the prediction into a letter because this model predicts uh, using numbers, the output is a number. So to turn it into a letter, I have a dictionary here with all the mappings. So S would be if it outputs 28, okay? Uh, then here we have just a list of this, okay? All these values. And now uh, we have this part. So the class that is predicted is just classes and then whichever element is the output for here, okay? Uh, and then here we have the config function that just changes the text to the predicted class. So like right now, um, if it predict, I input an image for sign letter Y, so it must have output a num uh, an array with the number 33 somewhere. And that uh, was then just uh, put right here, predicted class because that was translated to Y over here, okay? And that is basically how my app works. So thank you for listening to my presentation. And now I would like to give a special thanks to the team at Clevered who has helped me uh, through this entire time in this journey and given me guidance so that I can better understand AI 
and they have also um, imp uh, increased my passion for this topic. So now in the future, uh, I hope that I can make more programs that I can be proud of um, and that can help other people. Thank you.